Here I'm going to show you how to very quickly make your drop down lists in Excel. So here we have some years and months and days. And it can take a long time to input these by hand. So there's no external tables or anything like that here. We just want some quick, simple drop down lists. And when we hit Alt DL to go to the data validation window, you can see it's a comma separated list of values. And you don't want to be inputting that for days 1 to 31. But this isn't just for dates. This is for any list of values you want from your drop down menu very simply and very quickly. So the first thing is to go over here and to actually make your list. And there are many, many different ways to make the list. You could already have the list in Excel. So you imported some data, you deleted duplicates, and now you want to put it into a drop down menu very quickly. So here, since we're dealing with numbers, we can very quickly just go like that and take it down to whatever you want. And let's go ahead and make the next part of the list January. And we'll click that and drop it down. So like I said, this works great for dates, but your list can have whatever you want. So this step right here might be unique for you. And we are getting the full list of values. Now, the very next thing is once you have those, go over here and use the really, really nice text join function. It's a new function and it's great. The first argument is what do you want to use to combine all of the values? I want to use a comma. The next argument, ignore empty, very important here. Set that to true and then just select your list. Now, what I want to do here is just to select this list right here, but then we want to make this very quick. OK, so go to where it says F9 and just put a couple zeros behind it as long as you don't have anything below the list. Now, you could select an entire column, but in the downloadable file, you'll see that I do have a couple additional things above here. So we're going to go from F4 to F900 or whatever. Just make sure it encompasses everything. Close it up. Hit enter. And since we have the second argument set to true, we're not going to get anything else back here. It's going to ignore all of the empty cells. And the very next step is to click this guy, copy it. So control C, go down two cells and alt E S V enter. Copy paste special values. And that cell is not usually going to be bold. Now what you want to do is to click this guy, Grab this, go to the right, enter, then control C, go down to Alt ESV, enter, escape, double click, and go over here for the days, control enter to stay in the same cell, control C, down three, Alt ESV, enter. And now we have our lists. So we can go here, copy that guy over here, and Alt DL. Select a list from allow and paste that guy in there. And that's how you can very quickly make your drop down lists. So the secret sauce is get your list however you want to get it. And then use text join to combine it. And you want to save time, make it a really big range and drag the range between the columns and then copy and paste special values. Now, if you forget that shortcut, control C, alt ESV, once you copy this guy, you can, let me move it up a little bit, right click and go to paste special values right here. Or just go to paste special right here and you have all of the same options.